Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, so we got another review for you guys today. We're, you know, um, switching it up a little bit. We're gonna do some uh, some tennis shoes today. Um, these shoes, I've really been wanting to get a chance to get my hands on them. I finally got a chance to get my hands on them. So uh, I figured, why not do a review? Um, there's not many reviews on this shoe also, so there's not uh, much info and stuff and uh, you know, in-hand look at the shoe. And so that's what I'm hoping to give you guys today uh, a chance to check it out. So let's get right into it. Um, yeah, I, I've, been, I've been wanting these for a while now and uh, finally got my hands on them. H had to go through StockX, which it, it's, it, it's a price tag, but uh, definitely worth it. Yeah, so this is the Jordan Retro 15. Uh, as you can see, it's it's a really nice shoe. Um, I think you kind of you kind of you gotta be able to you gotta know what you're doing to pull it off. You know you gotta you gotta have a little bit of sauce to pull it off. Um, but I mean, if you can pull it off, it's it's a sick shoe. Just the way it looks, the way it fits, um, it's 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 ridiculous. And uh, yeah, the detailing is really nice on the shoe. Um, this part here is gonna be like a a Kevlar type of type of stitching um, you know how they do like the bulletproof vest and stuff that's the way that it's stitched and um, yeah it just it just looks really nice there's a lot of detail there's a Jordan symbol here on the on the side that's really nice um, also on the toe there's a Jordan symbol little tab on it um, the really cool thing about this shoe uh, it originally released in 1999 and uh, I pick up the other shoe as well. Uh, it came out in uh, 1999, and it was after the second time that Jordan retired. And uh, yeah, the way that he wanted to design this shoe was uh, to be like a, a X X15 or F15 fighter jet. I'm not sure which one, um, uh, but it's it's a it's a stealth fighter jet, and that's why it's got this type of uh, spaceshipy kind of feel to it. You know, futuristic type feel to it. Um, which is funny because this is the Jordan 15 and it's designed after an, an X-15 stealth fighter jet. Um, so yeah, that's that's how the design is. Um, the tongue is really nice on it. Uh, the way that the tongue was designed, Jordan went to Tinker, the guy who designs the, the Jordan, uh, most of the retros. And uh, he, he said he wanted the shoe to be like a fighter jet and he also wanted... You see how the tongue is kind of out? Um, I mean, if you guys seen Jordan play, uh, he plays with his tongue out, you know? When he's, when he's dunking, when he's going hard, he puts his tongue out, you know, to just let you know, like, mm, you know, like, just like, this is so nasty, you know? And uh, yeah, Jordan, his uncle, his uncle actually used to, used to um, stick his tongue out at him to be like, oh yeah, you know, just playing with him, like, mm, you know? And, uh, yeah, so not so that's that's the way Jordan plays. I mean, you guys all know that, and uh, yeah, there's there's some nice detailing on the bottom as well. Um, there's a date here, um, or actually, I'm not sure what these numbers are. I gotta look that up. I'll put it in the description below. Um, but yeah, there's a I don't know if it's on. It's the same on each shoe. Yeah, so two seventeen, twenty three six fifteen. I don't know, I wanna say this is a stat line, but I can't think of anything with a two that Jordan would have like averaged, you know? Maybe steals, I mean, two steals a game, that can't be points. Points gotta be 23, 15, I don't know. I wouldn't say rebounds or assists. I don't know, I gotta check that out. But this is, all in all, it's a really sick shoe. Uh, if you get your hands and get your, if you get a chance to get your hands on it, man, it's. It's ridiculous, uh, the way it fits, the way it feels, it's just like, you know, and like I said, you gotta have a little bit of sauce, you gotta have a little bit of drip to pull it off, but I mean, if you can, then this is definitely a shoe for you. Um, it also came out in a couple different colorways. Uh, the PSNY, Public School, uh, New York, they did a couple different colorways. I wasn't able to get my hands on those, not yet. Uh, if I do though, I'm definitely gonna make a video about that too, because it's just, it's, it's, just, uh, it's ridiculous the 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 way that these are styled, the way that they're they're made and everything. Um also I don't know if you guys have ever ordered anything from StockX. You get a cool little cool little card. 
and uh, you get this too. Um, this is actually a birthday present, so I'm not gonna look at the price of the shoe. Uh, and then you get a little uh, StockX sticker, which is really nice. You know, throw it on your phone, throw it on your car, laptop, whatever. Uh, whatever floats your boat. And um, yeah, all right, peace.